That's the hairy monster. Something strange was happening in Charlie's house. Charlie's dad was turning into a hairy monster. Charlie first noted it on Monday when dad came home from work. He had black hair on his chin. Mom called it a five o'clock shadow. She stretched dad's chin and gave him a kiss. On Tuesday, it was still there. On Wednesday, Dad's whole chin was covered with hair. His cheeks, too. On Thursday and Friday, Charlie did not see his dad at all. Mom said he was working late. Charlie thought that maybe he was out scaring people. Monsters like to do that sometimes. On Saturday, Charlie heard banging and playing in Matt's workshop. Charlie peeked in his bed. Was now a monster. I have to save him, Charlie said to himself. Charlie went to his friend, Julie. She knew a lot about catching monsters. Last week, she caught a slimy green monster in her backyard. I know what to do, Julie said. This magic potion will turn your daddy into back into his real self. Julie handed Charlie a small bottle. On Sunday, Charlie woke up early. He snuck up to his mom and dad's bathroom. Charlie could hear the water running in the sink. He could hear the monster singing. Charlie waited. The water stopped. Charlie moved into the bathroom. Take this, he shouted. He closed his eyes and flashed the magic potion at the monster's head. Charlie opened his eyes and looked up. What? What's up, Charlie? Dad asked. He dried his face with a towel. Towel, I saved you from becoming a hairy monster, said Charlie. There was a big smile on his face. Dad asked. You better give me more of that potion, he said. I don't want to turn into a hairy monster again. Dad patted the potion on his cheeks and neck. Charlie was happy to have 